What's the deal, y'all? We're Trapper Tapping in TNN and Trap News Network. We back with another reaction video. Y'all know the deal, man. Y'all know the deal. We here, we here, we here, we here. Uh, make sure y'all hit like, comment, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. Become a part of this rich Trapper Mafia. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hit that notification bell at the top. That one right there. Hit all. Make sure you hit all. Make sure you hit all. Make sure you hit all so you get all this fire content. This is the third video of the day. It's the first day of the year. We're going to make sure we keep this in rotation, man. Uh, I think I'm going to start doing a little monthly giveaways. Nothing too crazy, but like once a month. Uh, to my top commenter, you know what I'm saying? Whoever got the best comment. You know, that's what I'm going to start doing. Whoever got the best comment, the funniest comment, most insightful comment, whatever I think is the best comment of the month, you feel me? I'm going to go ahead and throw you $25 on the Cash App. You feel me? going to do that once a month. So make sure you leave them comments. That way y'all can get you a quick little $25, you feel me? It ain't nothing wrong. It ain't the most amount of money, but it ain't the least amount of money. Hey, it's a Chick-fil-A combo, though. Can't never lose with a Chick-fil-A combo. And if you don't like Chick-fil-A, something is just wrong with you. You're clearly the problem. But either way it go, man, make sure you follow me on Instagram, Trap News Network, T-R-A-P-N-E-W-S-N-E-T-W-O-R-X. That's Trap News Network. Find me on all streaming platforms, Rich Trapper, Game 6, Rich Trapper, Worth More Than Money, Rich Trapper, I'm Better Off Without You. And my two new singles, A Nightmare Before Christmas and Start From Scratch, are both out now. So make sure you go jump into all that. Uh, today, we got Poke from Hoover. You know what I'm saying? Uh... Sorry, let me go ahead and put this on. Had to send that last little message real quick. Put that on Don't Disturb. Uh, we got Pope from Hoover on Adam22, a.k.a. No Jumper. We black, so we call it Adam22. He on Adam22. Um, talking about his situational feelings with Crip Mac. Yes, man. He said that he don't really care for Crip Mac, but we finna hear more about it. And he said that that Hoover blank on Crip Mac's face is, yeah, not a good look. But without no further ado, or don'ts, man, we finna jump right into this content. Let's get to it. Three, two, let's go. He must have talked to me. He, he DM'd me uh, recently. Or somebody DM'd me on. Trayway's supposed to call at 3, 5 30. Oh, really? Yep. How's he doing? He wanna talk to you. He must have talked to me. He, he DM'd me uh, recently. Or somebody DM'd me on his behalf. He's good, though. He'd be out. Right. Mm -hmm. You stay in touch with him? Because weren't you the one who first like, uh, took him to the studio and shit? First studio, yeah. You just saw the talent, or? Nah, he got out of camp, like. Big bro, put me in the studio with him. I'm telling you I got gas. I'm the one. And I looked at Google, I'm like, I'm just shut up, Google. You don't know the rap. And then he started busting his little shit. And I forgot what it was, but he never dropped that. What he tell me? It was hard, though. Mm -hmm. I'm like, damn, all right. So he hit me out of nowhere, like, oh, I just got some hoes. Woo -woo -woo. Take me to the studio. And I'm like, oh, I'm going to take you to the studio. I took him to the studio. Him and the homie full active. That's in jail. Mm -hmm. Got on the song, and they told me to get on there. I said, no, nah, get y'all song. Just, you feel me? Mm. I'm a promoter for y'all. And it went viral, and he been going since. Right. You know I mean? Oh, that's fire. It does feel like there's like a curse or some shit when like Jap and Treyway both just get locked up super early on and stuff. Yeah, that was crazy. At the same time. And they get out on the same month. Right. Oh, and they're coming home at the same time. The same month. They well, be out soon, too. Well, that's going to be a, a big month for the for the team. I'm glad for you both of them, though. You excited about that? When Jab get out, the first interview he going to do is going to go crazy because they going to ask him about that squabbly wobbly with Crit Mag. Then they going to ask him about that squabbly wobbly with four extras. And then that squabbly wobbly conversation about four extras is going to for sure make four extras jump out and do his return, his response, probably nine times out of ten. And then, who knows, we might get a little celebrity boxing match real quick. You feel me? Hey, I think that if it had to go down and it went down like that, that's probably the most respectable and resourceful and economical way because not only can y'all air out y'all differences as gang members, y'all can make some chili doing it. So that's never a bad move. Yeah, no, I'm, they taking it. I know when they touch down, they drop something. It's a wrap. Right. For sure. Definitely. Because you, you feel like there's like a systematic grudge against the Hoovers, right? I heard it you. is. You know it is. I am not so sure. You can keep it real. Y'all favoritism, bro. We do? You too, on the set. Nobody has done more to help the Hoover yeah. community than me this year. This last couple of years. You Direct shot at T-Rail. Direct shot at Smack. Direct shot at back, at back on Fig. Well, he, bro, can't help himself, man. T-Rail made him so mad. T-Rail got him so bothered and upset that he can't help but to be disrespectful every chance he get. I promise you, whatever he's finna say next, it's finna be a slight shot. Ooh. You guys have a top podcaster now. Y'all have a nigga... <laughs> Who was born out of my building? Y'all have a nigga here with Ace Blank on his face. What'd I say? You can't help yourself. Ooh. You guys have a top podcaster now. Y'all have a nigga. <laughs> Who was born out of my building? Y'all have a nigga here with Ace Blank on his face, bro. Yeah, that's true, yeah. 
<laughs> we try to avoid that though. We don't let them talk about that yeah, shit too much. Stop, shit, I'll go. You not, you're not a fan? Of who? I was in a prison with this guy, and swear to God, on my mama, I thought this dude was from Fifth and Hill. Uh huh. And they're like, nah, go from 5'5. Five, five. Oh, threw me off. He didn't have that though. Back then? No. He didn't have that. Would that have changed how you felt about him if he had had that at the time? He wanted that. He just, what you mean? If you, I mean, when you're locked up and somebody has that tattooed on their forehead, I mean, he wouldn't have been there. Oh, he wouldn't have been that no. section. He wouldn't have been in that yard. Maxo was just talking to me about doing a boxing match with him. Maxo Groovy, I bet money on Maxo. You think? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I've got mixed thoughts. Let's do a bet, man. You. I've got mixed thoughts because I don't think Crip Mac is going to take that line down by no means. Mm, okay. If this ever happens. Ten bands. Ten? Shit. All right. You heard that. You heard that. <laughs> but now I feel fake. You yeah, heard that. I feel nope, fake. You heard that. Maxo just left and now I'm betting on it his It don't matter. Op. That's the homie. He from the set. And I've got ten bands on Maxo. Yeah, homie. I mean, to be fair, I've spent more time around Crip Mac than Maxo over the last few years, so... Oh, Arguably, Crim Mac might come home in the best shape of his life. He used his penitentiary time that he got to really get right mentally, spiritually, physically, and emotionally. To really buckle down and get it right up here, get it right right here. Crim Mac probably come back a beast. Hey, look. But it's not about that. It's about size. It's about agility. It's, it's not about, about no strength. Size, size I helps. Little, I seen the littlest nigga knock the biggest nigga out in the county jail. Right. Yeah, homie, but you homie. remember it because normally a big ass dude has a huge advantage over a little dude. You talking about slow groove? Slow groove? <laughs> Damn, homie. Like, what? Uh, yeah, you know. That's low key disrespectful as fuck to call Crit Max slow groove, but all right, let's see where this goes. I'm just saying, he's a big dude. Yeah. I've, like, go. we got into a little tussle. I got nothing to offer. That's bad on your behalf. Yeah, because that probably means, well, yeah. Yeah, it's not good. You got trophies for crazy shit. You can work out. <laughs> no, I work out, but I don't think I'm going to beat the natural size and strength of Crip Mac. But yeah, so you're, wait, you're not feeling the Mandingo Hall of Fame award? That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I need one of them. Let's see if I just pull some liquor out of her purse. Because <laughs> like I'm building my studio. Okay. I'm about to have that motherfucker decked out, though. Yeah. She snuck up fifth in here. Um, what's going to go on at the... Oh, wait, you, so you want the Mandingo Hall of Fame award for your studio? Nah, hell no. Nah. I need another award. <laughs> it's a lot going on in that room right now, big dog. It's a lot going on in that room. But I need another award. What's our over award? Right. See, you act like you don't want to talk about the gangbang shit, and that's the first thing you go for. That's all I know. I wasn't trying to throw that in there like that, though. Right. Um, and, and then the teleport... I ain't gonna lie, it shit kicked in. You been drinking all day? Nah, I ain't no drinker like that. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. That's all you do? You smoke and drink? Or are you got any other hobbies? I get money. Right, okay. Uh, I'm not the average. Ooh, nigga. You don't pop Molly? Nope. That's off limits? Yeah, homies, I don't. Oh, I, I believe you. I wouldn't want to do you it. You pop either. Molly? Ugh. You no. saying? I would have you a heart attack. Crystal? Say, no. Wait, did he ask that nigga, was he ashamed? <laughs> off limits? Yeah, homies, I don't. Oh, I, I believe you. I wouldn't want to do you it. You pop Molly? Yeah. You no. saying? I would oh, have Charm. a heart attack. Crystal? Do Charm is even crazier. <laughs> Are you ashamed? That nigga asked him, do we do Charm and do we do Crystal? No. But I've tried all that. That's crazy. Charm. Not Charm. Crack? No, but I snorted boatloads <laughs> of Coke. Do you ever snort Coke? Hell no. Really? On my kids. Never. Never even tried it? Dead homies. You, Never. Was, you sell I coke? slap it on my brother and all them people's hands on Hoover. Really? Never did it. That's pretty fucked up. I go to do a key bump and you're smacking it out of my hand? Oh, Hoover, they, they be, they fuck me. Yeah, don't do that shit in front of me. I'll smack that shit right about your hand. You'll be mad as fuck at me. I don't give a fuck. And I can fight. I'll smack that shit right about your hand. If you the homie, you can't be a go-go powder ranger around me. I'm not going for it. I'm sorry. Well, let me have a good time, man. Why can't you just let they me have a good sure, time? They for sure fuck me up. Go have a good time somewhere else, bro. Don't have a good time right here, bro. I ain't finna watch you kill yourself. That's out. Oh, free my How can you love somebody and say you they friend and all that and then watch them kill themselves? That's wild.
Brother, oh God. What, you were just convinced that them doing coke was going to ruin their lives? It can't. No, I, just, I just felt like it went right. Mm. You some, your nose, your brain there. Man, what the f***? Bitch, you go, what the f***? <laughs> it's weird because I've been to, like, neighborhoods doing vlogs or whatever. You've been to where? Neighborhoods. What did I say? <laughs> I've been to blocks. Where? Area. So because he's from Hoover, it's like, never mind. If you got it, you got it. If you didn't, you get it. Yeah. This is where people live. Where that's that? In Los Angeles. But I've, I've, been, I've been on clocks. I've right. been, Jesus Christ. I've been to a lot of places where wow. nobody would ever do coke in terms of all I'm gonna say is real quick, if you get an opportunity to go on no jumper and all that kind of stuff, be bigger than your circumstances, be bigger than your situations, be bigger than your surroundings, be bigger than your neighborhood, express yourself and represent yourself in a way that a brand might wanna pick you up because you are being seen by thousands upon thousands to potentially overall maybe millions of people over a long enough, millions of people over a long enough category, uh, long enough calendar, excuse me. These category and subjects live forever on the internet. These interviews live forever on the internet. So you never know if you'll ever get an opportunity like that again. So when you go on No Jumper, my personal opinion would be to present yourself in the best way possible to make sure that you can continue to do future endeavor, uh, future endeavors business-wise, not even with just No Jumper, but any maybe associated brand or brand that might want to be associated with No Jumper. You feel me? It, I'm just saying, that's just me. Never mind. Never mind. If you got it, you got it. If you didn't, you didn't. Of like the gang members. But everybody. I've been to a lot of places where nobody would ever do coke in terms of like the gang members. But everybody do coke. They'd but be off all type of shit. That's what I'm saying. Smoking I've been to Christmas. other neighborhoods where it's like, oh shit. Gang, 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 gang. What's going on? Gangland, yeah. I've been to other places where it's like everybody doing coke and they all secretly like trying to get it in. Go do some bumps. We don't do coke. Well, I can't speak for everybody. All right, well, that's that. We're going to go ahead and let that finish right there. But with that being said, man, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe for more of this content. If you ain't did that, make sure you do that. Hit that subscribe button. Become a part of this rich trapper mafia. Hit that notification bell at the top. Stay tapped in for the latest and the greatest. What we got going on. Find me on all streaming platforms. Rich Trapper, Game 6. Rich Trapper, worth more than money. Rich Trapper, I'm better off without you. And my two new singles, Start From Scratch and A Nightmare Before Christmas, are both out now. Find me on Instagram, Trap News Network, T-R-A-P-N-E-W-S-N-E-T-W-O-R. X. And we starting today, man. It's the first of the year. End of the month, we're going to give away $25 on Cash App to the monthly's top comment, man. If you got the top comment, whether it be funny, insightful, you know what I'm saying, provocative, if it gets the people going, all that. I don't know, man. As long as it's somehow entertaining to me, you can win that $25. Whoever does it best, that's who's going to win, man. But we about to here to the next one. And as always, Free Avenue Angel. We gone.